Do you want to get rich? Have the beautiful cars, the mansions, the jets, the jewelry, the beautiful partners? Well, I have good news and I have bad news. The bad news is that it's very unlikely that you will be ultra wealthy. But the good news is that for only $50,000, I will give you access to my course and mentorship program, and you will be guaranteed to be the next billionaire in your family. I'm kidding. But truth be told, it's not easy to get rich, but it's certainly easy to look rich. And it's even easier to go broke trying to look rich. And I know that this message is triggering influencers and Los Angeles residents everywhere, but it must be said. And I know this to be true because I fell for the trap. Because back in August of this year, I left my corporate job and I decided to go the entrepreneurial route. And given that I'll be losing a steady paycheck and a company car and moving to a city where I would have to pay rent and do a bunch of other things, I thought to myself, okay, what is the best way to go about this financially? I got it. I'm gonna buy a Tesla. And that's what I did. I bought a 2021 Tesla Model 3 and it was a beautiful car, phenomenal car, but the underlying theme was that I wanted to look the part before I actually was the part. Fast forward a few months into entrepreneurship and having bills to pay, I was looking at my budget and thought to myself, this was a mistake, but I got myself out of the situation, which I will be revealing at the end of this video. But the real question is, was it luck how I got myself out or was it the law of attraction at work? I am a magnet for wealth and abundance, but in all seriousness, I underestimated the challenge that is entrepreneurship and I overvalued the perception of others. One thing that I've always found fascinating is that you never really know what someone's financial situation is. For example, you got guys like Mark Zuckerberg and Bill Gates and Elon Musk who aren't the flashiest guys in the world, but they are some of the richest guys in the world. But then you see someone pull up next to you at the red light in the brand new Porsche. And you think to yourself, wow, this person must be loaded, but you never know. Maybe they're freaking out because their car is about to be repossessed and they're late on their mortgage payments because they're trying to look rich, but they're not actually rich. But the question becomes, why do so many people fall for this trap and get seduced by it? Well, I can't speak for everyone, but I can speak for myself. I would say that it stems from ego and insecurity. By having these nice things, it makes you feel like you're more of a success, even if you're not actually there yet, financially. You know, if someone is hating on you, you're like, ah, they're driving a Toyota Camry, I'm driving a Tesla. And I'm not saying that's the right thing to do, but it's a thought process, it is. You see, I got to a point where my bank account was slowly draining, given my car payment and car insurance payments on the Tesla, but my public perception was good. So, I solved the problem. I sold my Tesla. So truth be told, I never thought about selling the Tesla until a family member mentioned it to me because I always thought that when you buy a new car, the second you drive it off the lot, it depreciates. But I failed to take into account the car market shortage, especially among used cars, and an increased demand in electric cars. So lucky for me, I'm a genius, not really. And I made a tidy profit on my car. Was it calculated? Maybe, maybe not yourself you see I put a deposit down on my Tesla Model 3 in March of 2021 I put my deposit down when the car was priced at thirty seven thousand five hundred dollars by the time I got the car in August of 2021 the price of the car had gone up by twenty five hundred dollars so that was kind of like some built-in equity and over the last few weeks I went to every dealership you could really think of and honestly car shopping lives up to the hype it sucks and eventually I ended up selling my Tesla to CarMax for $49,000. So that is an $11,500 profit. And honestly, it sounds crazy, but it happened. The next video I'm gonna put out dives deeper into the actual money invested, cash on cash return, return on investment, and everything financial related to the Tesla investment. But for now, I learned some valuable things. My perception of money and wealth is changed for the better. I learned a very valuable lesson that it's easy to go broke trying to look rich. And if you overvalue your public perception, it could sink you. As I mentioned before, I got lucky. There have been many people before me who got sank by this type of move, but I was able to learn a valuable lesson and make a big profit while doing so. So learn from my mistake 
and I'm, I'm not always going to be as lucky. So I'm happy I learned it in the way that I did. But I appreciate you watching until the end. And as I mentioned, the next video I'm going to put out will dive deeper into the financials behind the investment. And all I got to say is it was a big cash on cash return. I'll see you on the next one. Stay fiscally responsible.